Hi, so this is just me playing around with vertical videos, uh, making use of the new tripod I got, and um, showing off my new toy. So the new toy is basically the Pilot Petite 1 um, pen. It's actually a fountain pen nib, as you can see from here. So just got it from the popular book fest. Um, it's actually like about, what, uh, three ringgit like that. It was actually super cheap. It's like no not not that big a difference from your regular um pilot pens thing um but i got it because one it's uh apparently it's quite uh you can actually get the refills and i actually got a refill although now i'm thinking it's like why was an why was i an idiot and i got uh three black refills and this pen is really black when i actually was complaining to myself that i wanted more blue oh sorry the usual price is about 840 but they were having a rebate i think it was about like five ringgit or something so yeah it's much cheaper not three ringgit um the refills were about four ringgit plus so i think it's about 425 for a pack of three which is actually not too bad so yeah um obviously i did try the pen before i decided to buy it um i've been starting to look into fountain pens because so many of my friends are into fountain pens and i actually still have a bit of a um trauma from school when we when they actually asked us to do calligraphy with the fountain pens so it's like nah. yeah so it's like thought might as well give it a try and it's a nice cute size um fits very nicely into my tiny bag um and um the tester i tried had really smooth nips so that's always a nice plus so now the only thing the thing i really don't like about these pens is that there's just always so many so much plastic that's attached to them you're like yeah i know that you guys want to make sure that people don't um people don't like misuse them and such but that come on like there's got to be a better way other than like like and the worst part is that you see how ugly the pen becomes because of like all those like sticky residue uh, it's really annoying um but yeah so yes yeah, so that said um i'm one of those people that i like to like make sure that i get all of it off and i try to get it all off in one piece simply because um less likely for there to be any residues left or in this case it's like yeah this this it's this one's gone it's like this is this part here is gonna like haunt me for like forever no no not forever but for enough of a time that it'll make me feel Ngh, every time i see it so wait uh, there's a bit here all right so that's it okay yeah i'm going to throw that plastic later on sadly not recyclable which is very annoying so um as you can see, um, cap's really nice. Um, basically, put it on to make it a full size pen. Otherwise, it would. It. I mean, you could write it like this, but it. This will annoy the hell out of me. It's actually very small for my hands, and my hands are tiny enough as it is. Um, I've gotten complaints that yeah, my hands are really very tiny. Uh, so yes, yeah, so, so the this is how it looks like. It's um, it's a nice nib on top here. I'm not sure whether the camera is going to pick it up, but basically, yeah, and it's see-through. So you can actually see the ink from what I've been told go through. And oh, cool. There's actually the nib here as well. I did not know that this was, this thing was, um, what do you call it? This thing was um, uh, so transparent. That's actually pretty cool. Not seen that before. So, okay. So according to the instructions I saw um, while I was um, in... Um, the book fest just now so i'm supposed to put this in until it punctures and ooh, now that is cool so yeah it's just like give it a few moments for the nib for the ink to sink all the way down to the nib and you can actually see it like oh wow now that is kind of fun and cool to watch all right okay so the nips it's all it's switched the nib already hope that means it's nice and saturated um as you can see it's actually it's very easy for you to see just how much um ink you have left and um how much uh uh basically how much mileage you can get out of this so yeah so that's done so let's do a quick writing test um this is actually an envelope from a friend's wedding but um hey probably not going to use the envelope again so yay let's just uh do a quick uh let's do it as da -di -da. oh did i miss out something was i supposed to remove something here oh no oh okay whoops right got my hair got a bit of that there and then oh this writes really nicely 
It's yes, my my handwriting's bad as you can tell, and yeah, that's basically my keyboard. Uh, but yeah, it's really nice and smooth and. Wow, the price is, is actually quite fun. I can see myself having lots of fun of, with this in the office, and it's like, yeah. The pilot petite one. Alright, yeah, so I've got this thing about gel ink pens and such, so this is very up much up my alley, and I think this is probably going to go straight into the office bag. Um, actually, no, it's probably not going to Got not going to even stay in the office, but it's probably going to stay in the office because then I get to play with this every day. Um, the only thing, like I said, why in the world was I such a genius and decided not to get the blue ink and decided to get the black ink? I have got like, at least like, like what three different black ink pens and I've only got one blue ink. Uh, it's like, uh, okay, never mind, that was me being silly, so yeah. Thanks. See you guys on the next one.